Hello there YouTube, Dylan Winks is here, and what's amazing is the past, I don't know, couple months since this whole Newtown tragedy, you know one thing that has been just on the rise, and that is just undeniably every American that loves guns dream, is concealed carry holders are on the rise. People concealed carrying are on the rise. And not only just people, but teachers. And there are people that are offering free classes for teachers right now. Concealed carry classes all over the country. Uh, especially in Utah where they're actually allowed to concealed carry. Now I see in Florida's future getting rid of the whole can't have a gun at school thing. We're kind of middle of the road with that. Uh, we were the first state with a legal concealed carry. Um, and we now are over 1 million concealed carriers, I'm guessing about 1.3, because a lot of people have been getting them. But uh, teachers in Pinellas County, uh, apparently, have been showing up for this free class on gun safety, and uh, which will lead to them getting their permits. But from what I hear, I talked to a guy the other day when I was at the gun store, I was, uh, I think I was at Gander Mountain, I was buying my P, uh, PT-638, my 380 uh, double stack, which is a badass gun, and I just love it. Um, I was talking to him, and he was talking about having to wait and wait and wait for his appointment to go up. What you do here in the state of Florida, you got two choices. You can either uh, send in your paperwork with your thumbprint, your photo ID, and all that crap to the Department of Agriculture and have your concealed carry permit back in six months or you could go to the department of agriculture sub offices in the state and do the fingerprinting a whole nine yards there for free not have to send it in they send it in electronically and you get your permit back in two weeks well basically the waiting to people have been making appointments to go do it the easy way uh, he said that he can't get one for three or four months. He's waiting for his appointment still. He took his carry class two months ago. So that just goes to show that there are a lot, a lot, a lot. And it was already on the rise since about July. Uh, I mean, it's just concealed carry permits are getting issued everywhere right now, especially to teachers and people who may not have liked guns to begin with. But with the gun and ammunition sales being at an all-time high, like, what was it, a uh, three years worth of guns and ammo were sold the week, one week after the, the uh, Connecticut shooting, like, and you're telling me that some Gallup poll said that people want gun control? I don't think so. I think that the money talks, and people spending their money is talking. And I think they know that they've opened the wrong can of worms trying to get into this gun control crap, but I think they know that they're going to lose. And I think they know if they do win, and they do pass those gun control laws, that we're not going to follow them. We're going to turn from law-abiding to constitutionally aware and moral people. I don't care what the law says. The Constitution says this. God said that, it's written on a goddamn piece of paper, and it's mine. It's not yours, government. But, everybody, it's good news that people are buying guns and ammo at a record rate. Yeah, it's harder for us to get our stuff. But, I've been telling y'all since, what, July? Go ahead and buy ammo now, buy ammo now, buy ammo now. There's not going to be any left, there's not going to be any left. And look what happened. Nobody listens to me. But I know there were a few smart people out there that listened to me. Anyway, guys, I'm just rambling. I'm signing off.